Okay, everyone, um, it's been a while since my last uh, video on Scribble. I have some exciting uh, uh, update in Scribble and I want to introduce you to subfolder and file organization. So let's get started. So let's clean these and let's go to our folders. So in Scribble now, um, you have the ability to create um, um, subfolder and a rename project. Let's see how it works. At the beginning, when you don't have any file, you can say new project. Let's assign a name test. And now when you have a project, within a project, you can either create a new note or a new folder inside the project. Let's create a note there. So this is my new note. When I save the note, I'm going to be prompt like usual with the default name. Let's save it. Now if we go back, this is as usual. The note is there. But um, if I start to create a new note from a specific project, the note will be by default saved in that given project. I can now, this is the big change, create a new folder too. So I create a subfolder. And I can then navigate inside the folder and create a new note inside the subfolder. Let's call it subfolder, subfolder note. That's it. If I save it, by default, that's where it goes. But I can change, save back on my top folder, or let's put it back, expand these, and save in the subfolder. Let's do that. When we go back, our new note is there. I can uh, rename um, any one of these subfolder or folders. Let's go back, for example, to the top folder and let's rename my project test in test renamed. I can also go here and open this project in isolation if I want to just focus on that specific project. The last interesting things I want to show you is that you can now use Explorer to organize your notes. And that can be handy. In some cases, um, Explorer is uh, it's much more flexible and it's e easier to move stuff around. So if you um, select either a folder or a note, and then from the Action button you say Show in Explorer, you're going to be brought to explore a window where are all your notes. Let's, for example, say that I want to duplicate this subfolder with all his notes. I'm going to do copy, paste. This is capability of Explorer there. And now I can go back to Scribble. I deselect and I say refresh. And when I say refresh, now my new subfolder show up. Isn't that awesome? Uh, so. I hope you enjoy this new update and um, send me your comment, suggestion, um, add um, your wishes in our wish list. Okay, thank you for listening. Bye.